Hey, what's up everybody? It's me again, and I think it's guitar time. You guys definitely want to see me playing more guitar poorly, right? Um, so here in this little book are the notes in braille for me in my special notation from, uh, well, I'll mention his channel. I don't know how to, well, yeah, I'll mention him in the, uh, in the link description. CWZ Guitar is the, um, the guy I need to thank for all of the notes that I have here for these three songs. I'm actually thinking of asking him for one more piece to not just a name. There's a particular version of that song that's got a beginning to it that I like. And I think I'm gonna, I'd like to maybe use it. So I'm not that good of a guitar player where I can just listen to it and know what note it is. So... I have to have somebody tell me. Um, so I may af have to ask him what those notes are. But for right now, um, I have three songs by Drab Majesty that I would very much like to cover a in a heavy metal genre. For those of you that have been following my channel, you know who Drab Majesty is by now. If you don't, you might want to go back and look at some of my other videos. I've met them. I was privileged to have done that. Um, very, very special band to me, and I can think of no better tribute than to, to do a couple of their songs in my style that I'd like to to attempt anyway um, eventually I'm gonna put them together with some other stuff and do like maybe a little little album of sorts and eventually present that to them um, kind of my magnum opus if you will my own little interpretations of their songs so I have three here I have not just a name, is the first one. That's a couple pages. There's that one. And then we have Cold Souls here, which goes for a little while. It's actually kind of long, but it's a lot of repeating. And a dialogue, which looks shorter, but is actually Based on what I've looked at, the most the the most complicated of the three. Um, I think I want to do. I want to do them in this order, because to to me, based on what I've seen, that's their order of difficulty. But that's just you know strictly my opinion. Some people might think otherwise. Um. Yeah, I'm going to put this down on the stand, and I will uh, just be telling you, I'm trying to, to describe, you know, what I'm doing. I hope if I could find the stand. I think it's back here. I moved it. Yep, I moved it. There it is. Okay, it's behind Deb's picture. So. If you don't know who Deb is, again, videos, super sweet. Uh, that's, that's all I'm going to say about that. So, I will get my guitar. Make sure I have a pick. Also, I have two different picks. Where'd they go? Please tell me I didn't lose them. Suck. Shit. I don't 
Sim. I can't find my picks. This is not good. Well, actually, I don't think I need the picks right now. I think I can just play without them. I have my amp here. You guys have seen this stuff, so... I'm pretty sure you have anyway. Just to make sure we're all connected the right way. Well, lots of cables. Yeah. Sorry guys. Probably not a very flattering view right now, but making sure. Everything is in order. That's my distortion pedal. From Deb, actually. And let's see, hold on. Let's see, are we on? It's all tangled. And plugged in. Yeah. Should be. Are we on? No. What the hell? All right. Rule number one don't panic. Make sure we're connected. <sighs> yep, I'm disorganized. <clears throat> That's me. Not a lot of space to work with down here either. That doesn't help. Long cable. Not forget that. Very long cable. Make sure they're all good. Get that out of there. Yeah, I've got a vocal booth. Now too, so oh man, everything is just everywhere right now. Okay, just EK, making sure everything's properly cabled and connected. That's my mic. Unplug that for a minute. It's a, what they call an XLR plug. 
very, uh, they're very big and they look cool. Sorry guys, I'm not quite as prepared as I was gonna be. That's alright. You all get to see behind the scenes. Oh, damn cute. Alright, now that's that and that. Oh wait. on. So there's that. Oh, that's loud. Holy shit, that's loud. Oh, that's even louder. Okay, let's turn that down. That's going to be stupid loud. Eventually we'll have this. <laughs> is off. So, I just have to figure out where in the connections, because I thought I had it right. <clears throat> now I don't appear to, so let me make sure. All right, plugged in here, plugged in here. And this is plugged into what? That, okay. Okay. What am I missing? Let's try this. Cause this I know will work. That's the distortion pedal. Hopefully it's not out of juice, but it might be because But I can still play this. Without that. I thought, what the hell? Why? Wait, does it go this way? Nope. Oh, 
that's why. I had them backwards. So now, let's do... That's a tone, this is pickup, that's volume. So now, <coughs> let's see if we can take this off, put this here. And then plug this into that. And this being the other end of the plug for the... Ow. Sorry, guys. All right. Anything? No? Nothing? Am I missing something? Hey. No, there's a right and wrong way to do this. I thought I had it plugged in the right way last time. Apparently that way is wrong. So, who knows? Let's try now. Anything? No. Okay, so either we are, I think I do have to plug this in, and I'm not sure where the plug is for this pedal. Let me see, hang on, I think it's over here, and we moved it to, let's see. There's like no room to get back there to see where it is. Shoot. I did promise you I was going to play, didn't I? I'm not sure where the plug went for this pedal. I mean, it'll still sound okay without it, but it's, it's supposed to be metal.
Well, this is definitely not going to sound as cool without that pedal. But we'll get it figured out eventually. So I guess for now, we'll just have to settle for clean playing. But I know there's a, a plug for this somewhere. But for right now, I guess we will settle. tactile way to play because if if I'm gonna play this the pick kind of takes away the my hands so I can't really feel where I'm at so I don't know if there are any blind guitar players out there that pick um, <clears throat> unless you use the what I call the deb technique which is to have very long, sharp, sexy fingernails. Um, okay. sort of matching thing <clears throat> so I'm just gonna play note by note by note it's gonna sound very slow and take forever but I've got to get these down otherwise we ain't gonna play so we go So it's that first dun, 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 dun. So it does that three, two, three, three a couple of times, so it's like that 
But it starts off up here. One, two, so it's like here. And then it does So it does that like twice, a, three, two, th yeah, three, two, three, 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 two, three, three, eight, three, three, two, three, 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 two, three, three. So when I say threes, uh, those are the frets and the letters are the, the notes, so, or the strings, I mean. So it's like here. And as far as placement goes, I don't know what the hell I'm doing, so, yeah. So I do that a couple of times. D <clears throat> after doing that a few times to and that D is open so it's just and then we move down <clears throat> to the 7 area instead of the 3 so we're going so So down here, so we're going seven, 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 five. So G, B, G, high E. So it's like. So it's a similar, similar to this, only it's down farther, so it's like about here, whoop, oh, ah, crap, I got the right spot though, without looking, <clears throat> okay, yeah, um, so we do that, it does that, 7775, seven, does that twice, and then, yeah, it does that a few times, then it goes back out over to the 3323 three, three with the B, yeah, does that, and then Seven 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 five again. So it would be like something like. Uh, So I'm using my fingers on this hand to play the notes, and I'm using my left hand to fret them, which I'm told is the the right way, but... And then it's... About, about right there. Uh, 
then it's up here again for two of these. About there. About there. Ah! goes like let's see um seven five seven five so it's like so instead of so it's like I guess my question is how do you how are the transitions happening that fast I guess is my question because there it's like dun 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 like that fast um is it just doing it over and over and over and over and practicing um yeah so then it goes back up to this. Just like before, and then it goes seven 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 open. So it goes like Trying to hear it in the song too, like and then it does like seven 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 wait seven 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 six seven so then it does like Three, three, two, three, open, three, three, okay, so it's, and then 
it goes. I said this was the easy one, didn't I? Okay, so it's like Then it does this. Let's see. Three. And it's like. Three, two, three, five. Wait a minute. Yeah. So it's like, so it goes like. Okay, yeah, I hear that. Uh, let's see. And then it's like, it goes like uh, three, and then it's like, uh, down this way, so it's like, do this, and you go, so it's like you put your finger on the bottom three strings and kind of roll it down as you as you play them so it's like yeah like like that something like that so I'm hearing the notes I'm, I'm just kind of feeling it out um I did say I was going to play all three but at this rate I'll be here for hours and hours and hours um yeah, I've already taken up a fair amount of time. So, anyway, it's time to knock some of this rust off because, um, yeah, this kid's got some work to do for sure. Blessed to be, though. We'll get there. It's just going to take time.